Hi guys, welcome to another video by me, Computer Fight, and today I have a video for you on Visual Basic. Now, I haven't done a video on Visual Basic for a few months now. Uh, this isn't usually a video that I would do, as I have uh, a web browser series on the go, which, by the way, I'm nearly process, uh, nearly finished perfecting. I've just added in a few more features, so it, that will be up hopefully soon. So let's get started so uh, as I can see in the title this is just like a Mac OS X button now I've seen this there's a f f camera around the tutorials I've seen but there's these tutorials that are quite advanced you have to add a picture box and things like that add certain buttons but what I've done is I've created a class file or a DLL to make it easier so what you have to do is you go on to uh, uh, your visual basic document so you want to import that for uh, that file what you do is go to choose items go to dotnet framework components browse for your file uh, so mine's in my documents uh, libraries nope not that in my DLL libraries my create DLL uh, wherever you save this download links below so we're here so just open that and make sure it's checked and click OK and then you will see this appearing so then what you want to do is once it's uh, done you can rename it to a different item so I'll just put OSX button for 6 and you could just drag it on and you've got your button there so you can resize it uh, my font set to Lucida Grand because I've got it installed uh, but yeah so you can change the font on there so you can change it to century gothic something like that and it will change to that and you can make maybe make it a bit bigger so uh, just to demonstrate how it works so you've got your button here and say you want to use this just drag it in and you even get your see how you get your click and it changes color you get your hover and it changes color things like that so you can be able to use this in your own applications so this is fully customizable fully customizable you can resize it you can add as many as you want in many as you want and yeah so that's all for me from this video guys uh, if you want any more DLLs made to download like Android buttons anything like that comment below and I will get to my hardest to get them to to make them for you so thanks for watching guys and I will see you again in the video.